You made it back. When you're ready, we have to get debriefed in the command room. Welcome back. Tell us everything you know. Pilot! Ah, good to see you're safe and sound. So, the GOOs this whole time were being piloted by drone bots. Drone bots? Piloting grinders? Looks like it. I can't believe this. Well, it explains why they seem to be in endless supply. I wonder if someone has gotten their hands on an old drone bot army. I wonder. All right, Frank, you're dismissed. Pilot, could you please speak with me in private when we're done here? I have a favor to ask. I have only been with Horizon Miners for five years. Chef, Shaheen, and Hans all have been with the company since the acquisition. I would like you to interview them to learn more about Horizon's history. Exactly what about Horizon would you like to discover? Fifteen years ago, Horizon was purchased by an investment company, Exo Yield Enterprises. There is very little paperwork available on how Horizon functioned before they were acquired, but we have some employees on board who may have some idea. Do you think this has to do with the drone bot jacks, Nebru? Perhaps. I would go with you myself, but I have a report I need to file to corporate. All right. We will go speak with the crew. Have you spoken to Jess? It seems like she's upset with me for some reason. Everything you know about the Horizon and Exoyield merger immediately. Oh, well, uh, I mean, I was hired right around the time that Horizon was purchased by Exoyield. Continue. It was 15 years ago, but I still remember it clearly. From the get go, you knew you were going into a rat's nest. I mean, this company was run like a hoarder's house. I was hired as a mechanical engineer to take inventory of equipment and make a note of repairs. Boy, I had my work cut out for me. Poorly serviced machinery, grinders all over the place, and drone bots. Drone bots everywhere. What do you mean? Previous company used a lot of drone bots, but it was as if they had no one to service them. They were in such disrepair. Interesting. Thank you, Hans. Hello there, pilot. I hear you've been busy. Hello, Diesel. Yes, we have been busy. We discovered that the enemy forces we have been fighting are drone bots. Oh my, drone bots, piloting grinders. That sounds so cool. I mean, darn those nasty drone bots for repeatedly attacking you. That's no, not nice. Not nice at all. Horizon used to have a lot of drone bots, a lot. I was made from parts of some of them. Sometimes I think I can hear their thoughts. Uh. They broke a lot of rules, didn't follow any union regulation whatsoever. Extremely not good, but they were designed that way. Why were they designed that way, Diesel? Don't know, your guess is as good as mine. Pilot, hello, hello. Diesel, did you need us to get you something? I'm very surprised. How did you know? You ask us for something whenever we speak. It's the basic algorithm at this point. Well, if you don't mind, I would love it if you could find me something. Of course. Please bring me cash. Excuse me. You know, cash. Currency. In the physical form. Cold, hard. I'll see what I can do, Diesel. J 
Yes. What do you need, Blue? Cash. Excuse me? We are requiring cash. Well, I can lend you some, but you have to pay me right back. It doesn't belong to me. It's everyone's pooled cash from the bet I took a while ago. What if I cannot pay you back? Then no cash. Interesting. What if we participated in an exchange? Are you trying to bribe me? It can be my birthday present. Blue, you're an AI. Yes. You don't have a birthday. This is discrimination. Jess, it's not for us. It's for Diesel. Oh, it's for Diesel? Diesel requires the cash. Well, in that case, okay. Okay. You don't have to pay me back. You can have one cred bit. Just one. That's good enough. Thank you, Jess. Yeah, yeah. You found it, physical credits. Well, we didn't find it exactly. This is perfect. It will go right into my grind. Yes. Coffee grinder. Ugh, Jess likes coffee, and I was going to try and make her some, and Ugh need to smash beans to make beans into bean juice. Ugh. Thank you for the physical currency. Diesel, you didn't tell us your conspiracy. Oh yes, of course. I was too occupied with my bean grinder. Of course. Earlier you were talking about robots piloting grinders. Yes. They have to be controlled by someone you know. Controlled. Drone bots don't just decide to get in a grinder and attack others, unless someone told them to. We are supposed to be nice robots. Minimal intelligence robots. Something like that. Well, thank you for your insight, Diesel. You're still here, huh? Pilot enjoys the engine room. That's your pilot. Is it the loud noises or the overpowering smell of burning fuel? So, Frank... What about Frank? I am sensing some animosity. I don't know what you're talking about. I am detecting increased levels of animosity. Shoot! Are you and Frank fighting? No, not really. It's none of your business. Everything is my business. No, it isn't. Don't you have anything better to be doing right now? Don't you have anything better to be doing right now? Let's see what Chef has to say. Why, hello Chef. Have you spawned any of your alluring Montgard culinary creations today? Well... Okay, enough small size talk. I am here for gossip. Oh. Who says I have gossip? Never has informed me that you are an old timer. You were hired to Horizon 15 years ago, around the time of the corporate acquisition. She believes that you may have information that could help us with the mystery grinder attacks. Interesting. Well. I suppose it couldn't hurt to share what I know. I was hired when the investment firm ExoYield purchased Horizon. I have worked on previous ExoYield projects before and was assigned to work as Horizon's very first chef. They didn't have a single chef before me. <laughs> Could you imagine? I suppose that's because they didn't have many employees. There were only two human employees on Topaz when I was first stationed there. There were only two miners stationed on Topaz. Two employees. I suppose that they were transitioning their workers out after the acquisition. But it was an odd sight to see. Anyway, that's all I have to say. Hello. Aren't you going to offer one of your suspicious gourmet meals, Chef? Unfortunately, I have nothing prepared for today. 
Space is not very bountiful when it comes to fresh, nutritious ingredients. Hello, chef. Hello. I see you're still on board. Well, I'm up for a vacation soon, so I figured that would be well spent on Shaheen's ship. If you wouldn't mind, I would love to get a chance to get back in the kitchen and whip up something good. I will consider the possibility of a future collaboration. I wonder what's going on in the junction. Frank's here. Is this where you enjoy spending your breaks, Frank? Well, not exactly. Oh, I understand. It kind of smells like garbage in here, doesn't it? Yeah, a bit. Interesting. Well, I think it's time to explore the engine room. You don't think Jess is upset that I took you on the mission, do you? Nah, that can't be it. Why would she want to go barreling through space while getting shot at? You would have to be crazy to want to do that. Maybe it was those traditional pastries that she gave me and I threw out. Do you think she would care about that? She's not very sentimental. I don't think that she would get upset over pastries. I wonder. There must be a reason why she's not speaking to me. There must be a reason why she's not speaking to me. Don't you have anything better to be doing right now? Jess, will you show me how to braid your hair again? Maybe later, Diesel. Jess should hang out with us more often. <laughs> I'll think about it. Do do do. We should leave him be. That explosion was a doozy to fix up. Blasted right through the fuel tanks. Could have fooled me. You repaired it in what, 30 minutes? Should have taken me 10. You're a handy assistant, Jess. I appreciate that you know the names of all the tools. What? Are you comparing me to Frank? Had fun repairing the engines today. <laughs> Nothing like a death-defying accident to clean the rust from between your ears. It was a mine that damaged the tanks. Did a pretty serious job, but uh, well, we managed to patch it up in no time. I have to say, the damage from a mine could have been much worse. Are you bored? I was about to speak with Hans, but uh, I'm not sure if I'm seeing things. What things are you seeing? Is that a drone bot? There is a drone boat operating on board this ship. Surely this is a violation of the Wera Act. I wonder how should I bring this up with Shaheen? I wonder how should I bring this up with Shaheen? There must be a reason why she's not speaking to me. Shahin never has instructed us to obtain historical gossip from you. <laughs> yeah, I could hear her from over here. What do you want to know? You must tell us everything about the state of Horizon when you joined the company. Well, it was a long time ago. I was contracted by Horizon before the merger, mostly to conduct transport. And? Nothing too unusual. We would transport in equipment and load at the base and transport out product, usually six months stints. I believe another contractor was handling the crew transport at that time. 
Although I never cross paths with them. So, did they operate within legal guidelines? Well, Horizon had a contract to mine most of the Serra system, but they never dealt with official paperwork. Everything was off the books. It paid well, so we didn't ask questions. Interesting. Thank you, Shaheen. Thank you, Shaheen. You're very welcome. We have received a sordid gossip, Nebru. Sordid? Well, let's hear it then. Right. According to the crew, Horizon before the Exoil acquisition had a suspicious number of drone bots in operation, who were apparently not operating to Union Co. Horizon did not conduct any business with official paperwork. We also learned that there were very few human employees working on Topaz for a period of time, and no chefs. Aha. I believe we've proven your suspicions correct, Nebru. What suspicions have been proven? After Horizon was purchased by ExoYield, ExoYield discovered undisclosed information in Horizon's records. Apparently, Horizon had been using drone bots to mine in the Ceres system 15 whole years after the Wera Act was implemented. These drone bot mining sites were outright abandoned after the company was acquired. Do you believe that these drone bots are related to the ones attacking us? Well, where else could they come from? I managed to obtain records of the original Horizon bases. Apparently, the largest and most active base was on Palladium. Palladium? I never knew we had a base on Palladium. I believe someone has taken over this base on Palladium and has used the abandoned drone bots at the base to attack Horizon mines in the Ceres system. That makes sense. And if they have access to a carrier, then they can easily transport grinders from planet to planet. But if this is all true, I have no idea what we should do next. Flying right out to Palladium does seem a bit foolhardy, doesn't it? Captain? Nebaru? Have we received commands from Horizon about our next move? Not yet. Why, do you have a suggestion, Hans? Yeah, I do. Now that we know our enemies are drone bots, we can equip ourselves to fight against them. With Bellingham. Bellingham? Interesting. Continue, Hans. The other day, Diesel got his hands on a bit of orange Bellingham that I had in me things, and I knocked him out cold. If Diesel has this weakness towards orange Bellingham, this means other drone bots will too. Now, I could engineer a weapon that uses orange bells. We could launch a real counterattack against these drone bots instead of just defending ourselves. And where do we get these orange bells? Oh, aren't they quite rare? In the Ceres system, the only place they can be found is on Osmium. If we want the good stuff, we go there. Well, that solves it then. We're heading for Osmium. Then, once we get our handy weapons, we will go straight to the source of the drone bots. Palladium. Captain, we need to get permission from corporate first. I'll get my shots out. Hans, good plan. We'll be sticking to it. Oh. Oh, boy. It looks like we're shotting our way to Osmium. Hope you kids packed your mittens. We're headed to Osmium. Make sure to wear your woolly socks. Humans like to come up with a lot of funny names for things. Horizon, Exoil, Extractors. A series of numbers would be easier to keep track of. Ah, Frenchie. So I take it you've heard our recent discovery. About the G-Wars? Yes, I have. Well, uh, I know that tone of voice. You have a bone to pick with me, don't you? 
You know me too well. Keen, it's unlike you. I thought you were more supportive of the Union than this. So you met Diesel? Diesel is the name. Look, I don't know why you have a drone bot on board, but it's, uh, unsettling. Diesel's unsettling? Did you ask him about his list of fears? It's very long. Shaheen, you are missing the point. You used to strictly enforce the Wera Act on board your ships, and I respected that. And now you have a drone bot on board. That could be a human worker in its place. An engineer's apprentice who needs to build skills and feed their family. I'm disappointed if I'm to be honest. <laughs> You've always seen things in black and white, Frenchie. And you've never taken those who disagree with you seriously. Diesel's purpose on board isn't to replace a human worker. But if you don't believe me, you can see for yourself. And if I'm not satisfied that Diesel doesn't break the wear act? <laughs> well, you can always turn me over to the authorities. Don't call my bluff, Shaheen. Oh, I would never do that, old friend. I've never seen Never willing to go against corporate rules like this. Things are getting exciting around here. Nebaru, how's the damage control going? Your call is being recorded for quality and training purposes. That good, huh? Quite the mystery we have on our hands, isn't it? I need a drink. Next stop, Osmium. Next stop, Osmium. Is it all right to travel to Osmium and Palladium without getting permission first? My commanding officer is going to reprimand me for this. The GUO attacks have been growing in frequency and intensity, but corporate has ignored many of my calls. We may have to take this into our own hands. I need to get it together. In the end, this is for the greater good. Even if I lose my job, it's better than death. Probably. Hello, Horizon. Yes, this is Nebaru from Horizon Security Transport Ship, The Competence. Well, I better get my route planned out. I feel like I need an expansion on my memory after receiving all this information. I have to say, it concerns me that we are going to a planet full of bellying designed to incapacitate my systems. But I trust you will keep me safe.